blessed day to all of you, dear brothers and sisters. Today is December 23, and there are two days left before Christmas. It's very near. Christmas is fast approaching. Well, the gospel for today talks about uh, Zechariah and Elizabeth and the naming of the child. You see, um, in the life of uh, Zechariah and Elizabeth, a miracle had happened. Why? Because, uh, as we all know, Elizabeth was barren and advanced in years, as well as Zechariah. But the will of the Lord for them is to have a child. At, and then, Zechariah did not believe at first to the uh, miracle of their lives. And so he became mute and not able to speak. And during the time, Elizabeth was so joyful and his joy is infectious that his, her relative joined in the celebration, especially in the naming of the child. And so, they are going to call him Zechariah the Junior. Zechariah Junior. But then, when Zechariah was asked, he wrote in the tablet, No, John must be his name. From that moment on, after writing on the, on the tablet, his mouth was open and was able to mount John. John must be his name. Dear brothers and sisters, miracles do happen for those people who believe. Many times in our life we doubt God's presence in our life. But look, we are surrounded with many gifts. The name of John is God's gracious gift. God's favor, God's great favor. And John is a God's great favor coming from God. This Christmas is an invitation for us to become like John. We become a gift to one another. What we receive is our gift of ourselves from God. We are all gifts. But we are called to become gift to others. And a gift does not become a gift unless it is given. When God the Father gave His only Son, it is with pain. It is with pain that He gave His only Son. So when we give, it, is, it must be with pain. So that the real measure of give or giving is pain. When we experience pain in giving, we share parts of ourselves. And so therefore, dear brothers and sisters, don't ask, what is my gift today? You better ask today, what is my gift for my loved ones? What is my gift to Jesus? God has given us the greatest gift in the world, namely Jesus Christ. What about your gift to Jesus? Maybe a renewed heart and a renewed spirit. This can be the best gift ever. Amen. Father God, listen to our prayers and petitions. As you please touch and heal the people who are very sick right at this very moment. People who may not receive so many gifts. People who are materially poor. Give them spiritual blessing and a spiritual wealth, such as peace, joy, happiness, unity, harmony in their family, which the world cannot give. Especially, Lord, please heal those people who are in the hospital now, those people who are suffering and wounded, those who are in pain. Please touch them and heal them. In the name of Jesus, Son of the living God, receive the healing thoughts of the Lord as I anoint and bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. God bless you, dear brothers and sisters. Again, please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, Kamay Nesos Altanghap, and like our video presentation. Thank you, and God bless us all. Amen and amen.